Thank you, guys. That was very kind. Yeah, well, they're very happy. I knew they, it was a surprise, and I knew they'd be very excited to see you. So. You know, um, I was driving onto the lot today, and I was having this surreal moment because I was like, I'm kind of, I'm getting emotional a little bit. Yeah. it's. Because uh, I was like, this is it. Well, it's a long Last time. Last time I'll see you here. I mean, I'm going to see you. Yeah. But, but here, in this form, I mean, you were my second guest. Uh, that's I, right. I mean, I was so excited to have you on as my second guest. You were 22 years old. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, I, I, we really dressed up for you. Yeah. <laughs> you were, we gave you our first pair of Ellen underwear. We hadn't that's given right. them out at that time, but I gave you, and you put them on One of on the your, best moments of my life. You put them... On your head, you didn't know how to wear underwear at that time. Yeah, yeah. Well, I was only 22. Yeah, um, you learned shortly after that. Yeah, you put them on another. I, you know, I feel like it really. I feel like it was one of the b biggest sellers in the gift shop after that moment. So, I don't know. I kind of feel like uh, maybe we should go back and you can cut me in a little bit on that. <laughs> no. 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 I I think you're okay. doing okay. <laughs> my well, gut, my gut says those songs you write do do okay. Yeah. Um, where did we meet? We were talking about this this morning because I knew you obviously before the show because I said I wanted you on right away, but I don't remember how we met or where we met. I think we met um, when I was much younger, closer to to that guy uh, who we just saw. Um, I would do these shows after the shows. Uh, when I was on tour. And in, in LA, we played uh, House of Blues, and I think you came to that show. It was like 1 a.m. Yes. We put the tickets on sale. We, we had, I was playing Staples, which is now called Crypto yes. Center. Yes, yes. I feel so old right now. I know. Um, <laughs> and, uh, and I was playing uh, at the House of Blues in LA, and you came. Yes. It was like 1 a.m. Alcohol was consumed. Yes. And we were like, we're the best friends now. Yeah. Um, yes, that is where. And yeah. Nas was there that night. I, I think met so. Nas. Yeah. 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 That was it. That was an amazing show, because it was such a small little. And then, you know, of course, I got to see you here all the time. But it was amazing to see you in such an intimate, you know, setting like that. Uh, I was thinking it could be fun to do those again. You should. Yeah. People would love that, to do I, those small little... Play it in, in, intimate? More yes. Intimate. Yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah, it was, it, was, uh, it was 1 a.m. I don't know what time we went to sleep, but now we both go now, to sleep yeah. at like 8 yeah. or 9 p.m. I, I, honestly, I honestly go to <laughs> sleep by the 10.30, the latest. Sometimes 9.30 or 10. What time do you go to bed? If I'm in the studio, all bets are off, but I like to be in bed by like 10.30. Yeah. The you're... only reason I would be up at 1 a.m. is if I hear, you know. Because uh, of Jessica. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. She, uh, she's a whiner. Uh, um, but how, <laughs> you, how, I'm not, you're not getting me in trouble yeah. just because it's the last time you have the opportunity. <laughs> No, but how about that? So when we met, neither of us were married. I've been I've been married now 14 years. I've been to get yeah. and, and you're married 10 years. It'll be it'll be 10 in October. And you have two yeah. kids and two kids, two beautiful boys. That's amazing. Yeah. I mean, it's like a, that's why like 19 years is a lifetime. That's it you've is. been and you've been here 24 times. 24 times? Yeah. Is that but is that more than anyone else? No. If it's not, then just say it is. It is. No. Thank you, Andy. <laughs> no, you, you're, you're too busy traveling and touring. Um, what suggestions do you have for me? Because I'm about to have a lot of free time, so I'm asking everybody. Oh, no, I wrote some down, actually. Oh, wow, um, okay. <laughs> yeah, well, that's, you know, best friends. <laughs> um, I wrote hobbies for Ellen. Oh. Um, uh, the first one is I know someone who has two boys that if you felt like babysitting at any point, <laughs> um, you know, just so mom and dad okay. can have like a night. Okay, you're not missing that one. No. Um, pottery. Uh, okay, <laughs> this is going great. Uh, candle making. Mm -mm. 
Ooh, this one I really like. You could become a beekeeper and make your own honey. I, yeah, I'll do that. Um, we need to save the bees. I will do that. Save the bees. Have your own bees. Mm-hmm. Um, we'll come up with a name for them. Um, for all of bees? All your bees. Well, no, you don't name the bees. You don't? No, I, d I don't think so. I, all right, well. You can't really tell them apart. I mean, ag agree to disagree. <laughs> OK. Um, <laughs> Uh, uh, like coaching kids sports team, like soccer. No, you're back to or, kids again. Okay. We're gonna take a break. <laughs> we're gonna take a break and then we're gonna play a game. We'll be back. Okay. <laughs>